gonna be cheesy and call this my drive time decompress because I have to drive uh, roughly an hour to and from work each day. challenging but rewarding most of the time uh, a lot of days I just feel a uh, pretty strong case of imposter syndrome I produced for about two years before circumstances led me to have to leave the TV circumstances allowed me to come back to TV, but uh, now I have to commute, which is, uh, again, basically the main reason I quit. Not quit. Well, kind of quit. Uh, the last time. But, um, it's hard sometimes, because, like, some days... It's really just making the sausage. Other days, uh, you know, if things come together just right, it can be really good. Working in news is like being on drugs, but you don't know if you're taking Tylenol that day or. speculate about other drugs, but anyway, um, there's definitely a, a addictive, um, adrenaline rush, uh, aspect to working in news, uh, one of my co-workers described it today as, like, hours of boredom punctuated by moments of sheer terror about sums it up, especially in days like today. Uh, I can usually gauge uh, my level of frustration by if I'm cursing in my head or under my breath or loud enough for the entire newsroom to potentially hear it when something goes wrong. So, uh, but that's, uh, again, that's kind of just the business. So, I don't know. Today was one of those days that things came together. It felt like more in spite of my efforts than because of them. Uh, I have a ton of great people that work with me that help me uh, take care of stuff. And, I mean, it is always going to be a team effort, but uh, it's, it's difficult things don't go exactly as you would have hoped. So, but, um, again, for metaphors, uh, I do subscribe to the idea that live TV is always going to be like uh, building sandcastles at low tide. It doesn't matter how great they are or how shitty they are. creating a thing that exists really only for a moment in time. Even with DVRs and streaming and everything else, uh, it is a, uh, a unique uh, medium. So, but anyway, I, uh, I'm going to have to stop and pick up McDonald's on the way home. Uh, those of you who watched my earlier video today know that messed up my sweet tea. This is a different McDonald's, but we'll see if they do any better. Uh, I'm probably going to get Diet Dr. Pepper because for some reason the McDonald's in my uh, town that we live in now, they don't always have Diet Dr. Pepper. One does, one doesn't. Anyway, I'm rambling. That's all for right now.